if you valued them at 200 let's just say and i agree with that what, are you okay with me giving you half of that this ain't gonna be a whole lot that's okay that'd be like 60 bucks if i have two wrestling guys in mind can i trade for them <laughs> yeah show it me be, what, i'll be close to 60. yeah show me what you got okay. i'm right at seven all right, so then you owe me money. Okay. <laughs> okay. So then what I would do is I'm going to come in and half that. Right. So I'd give you... <laughs> They're uh, micro brawlers. They have pro wrestling credit exclusives. So what do you mean pro wrestling credit? They're pro wrestling crate. You oh. crate and it comes with exclusive figures in it. I, I do have them a little priced out. This is about what they're selling for individually, but it's, it's a very select market. Yeah, I have a feeling so, that would. If you're not interested in me, that's fine. Bro. Yeah, I probably, because I'll be honest, I'd have to throw these on eBay or something. Yeah, no, I got you. And I. Yeah. I mean, I got some big guys. There's like Bruiser Brody, Macho, uh, Ultimate Warrior, Raven. Um, I think Bret Hart's in there. But if you're not in those, that's cool. Yeah. I know a little bit newer. Everything else is yeah, cold. All right, so yeah, I'll pass on that. Yeah, that's fine. And then I have that's loose weapons. This is also loose weapons. So and do you know whose stuff this is? So I do. Most of <laughs> most of most of the He Man I do. That I don't. I think this is maybe maybe junk. That's probably just some yeah. goofy radio. This is Power Ranger guy. Turtles, He Man. Yeah, yeah. Um Power Ranger. This is all He Man except for the crossbow, that's shoe. And then these I have the weapons willing if they have. Them. So a lot of these are complete. Like I have a complete trap jaw. I know this dude's small soldiers. Yep, yep. He's pretty cool. We just came from the full market. <laughs> oh, cool. Yeah, you just never get the... Yeah. So the real blast, just no parts? No parts for him. Are the yeah. things in his legs? Yeah, they are, I think. And in his chest also. Yep. yep. We got some He-Mans, Travis. He-Mans. Do you know what the sword is with I have not, handle? This is in an unknown bin. I don't know what this is. I mean, that's Superhuman Samurai. Yep. I actually asked Travis about that sword with the bone handle the last time I came in. This is, I was like, it's really confusing. It, it looks familiar, just, I just don't know. Kenner aliens. Uh, Predator yeah. aliens. Predator. Kenner Predator. Um, yeah, that one I don't know. Is this oh, the, that's Jafar's. Is it Jafar's? Yep. Is this like the Bible Warriors? guy? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. The, the ones on the Mego bodies? They're like Mego bodies, but... Yeah. I think different scale. Like that, that I don't. Well, uh, that I don't know. So I don't know. This is either VR Gargoyles. Troopers or Power Rangers. So I think it's VR. This is who? Gargoyles. Mm. That was Brooklyn's motorcycle. I didn't have the handy stuff. Gray Skull. So that has all the pieces and one extra piece. I got a bunch of these in the back and really? I never put them out because I don't have space. I don't. Yeah. They're really cool, especially with like Mighty Max when it's so popular right now. So the one piece that doesn't go with it is the arm. Okay. The river, the trees, and then the two Pokemon. And then that's it. I'm pretty sure that's complete. And then I, if I have the weapons with them, they're in there. Those are some. And yeah. that's what she's probably looking for. Yeah. And then apparently the Man at Arms is Red Dot. Yeah, yeah that's first, first release. release. Yeah, and then I have um, Merman for the Green Belt. I don't know. How did you... <laughs> well, so far, Merman first and second release, it, it's not much different in price. Right. They constantly switch places, but that's what you're going for. This is skeletal armor, but that's a dragon blast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it mixed up, I guess. Well, I, I mean, it's a skeleton. So but yeah, it's, I guess. This one, the boots are different. Okay. Yeah. This is black. Okay. And it's like a rubber, like a solid head. Yeah, yeah. That comes with Dragon Blaster Skeletor. Okay. Which is different than the regular. Gotcha. The armor's still good, yeah. 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 Yo, I'm sure y'all got it. Can we see how the feet are different back. color? Yeah, I noticed yeah. that when I was looking at it. I thought it was odd. No break. Trap Jaws got all this stuff. Accessory pack sword. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. No, I threw it in there because it said it was like some kind of. I'm not sure if it works. So. If it were a regular Skeletor, yeah. the boots would be more like that color, even though this is a just a you know, battle armor one. But, but even that's the, the coloring yeah, for the regular Skeletor. Sometimes it comes in half. Gotcha. And then there's this. That was just me quick. Like if you look, the feet are bigger. Yeah, most of the vehicles. Right. And they did do a re-release of Skeletor with this body, but the feet are still that color. 
<laughs> I'm not seeing carded Dukes of Hazard. Oh, let me grab them. I'm sorry, I forgot those. Chewbacca. All right. So, yeah, and then do that. And then you got those two. No battery cover. This is all stripped. I'm seeing no front. I'm seeing problems. Oh yeah. Well, like I told them, if that had that in that, it would you'd be stretching that. Yeah, yeah. Just some good old boys. Oh, wow. Yeah, and they haven't like really discolored inside. Yeah. I mean, his waist is a little bit still. Oh, they're pretty good. Yeah. And then the Punisher. I think that's Oh, yeah. When they first started. Yeah, that's a big bazooka. <laughs> oh, and you got more Mo2 in here. Yeah, I do. Because we were just fanning out. Because I don't want 24 hours. Alright. Well, you just have that. And then these are the big big Power Ranger guys. Yeah, that's part of Yeah. Okay. Well, then you tell me that. I'm going to finalize this in my brain. I think I know. So it seems like they like boot bow more than Duke. What were you thinking on those carded figures out of curiosity? Because the pricing is just. I had them at 100 each, where I haven't listed. It's just got a lot of variation. Yeah. And I only have them on Marketplace. And I think I've had like 30 people messaging me, but you know how Marketplace is. It's more of a hassle than it's worth. Hmm. Because I mean, some, I mean, $49.99, $56. I mean, the cards are nice, though. Yeah. But, I mean, look at this Luke Duke. Three yeah. Five bucks. Yeah. I mean, obviously, that's... Don't do auction. No. You're going to lose your butt. Yeah. There's just not enough buyers out there right now. So you just put a fixed price and hold. That's what I... I, I, don't, I rarely do auction. Yeah, no. I just, I just sit on if I have to. Whenever you scroll through stuff and you find the guys that stole something, it's because it was yeah, it was auction. So somebody didn't know what they had. I was gonna do store credit. You got some stuff I'm wanting now. Well, if you if if you valued them at two hundred, let's just say, and I agree with that, what, are you okay with me giving you half of that? Yeah. So then I would do that. Okay. Just because they're nice carded examples. So. What's for the lot, you think? Woody, so we're... So Still working? Separate from Bo and Luke. I mean, the, the He-Man, that's kind of... A, sure. Is that counting Punisher and everything that's laying on the floor and the parts? And, uh, I was just trying to figure out. 30, 30 yeah, yeah. He's, Something like that. I don't think he's anything. Not too great. Not so. Uh, but I, I mean... I mean, the Power Ranger guns aren't anything, but they're G1 parts. And the Mo2 Thunder Punch is probably a good shield. I'd probably say that would be the value. Of All right. So, then, so for the remaining stuff, it would be $150. Okay. So 250 correct? Right. Sounds good to me. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah. All, right. All right. So then we're going to... You don't need your box back? No, you can have my tomato box. All right. <laughs> What's the uh, do to the orange pants? Uh, it's like a figure you plug into a base and they punch and kick. I forget the name of it. That Marvel did them. Uh, oh, like Mortal yeah, Kombat did them. Yeah. yeah. I brought a uh, Wield Warriors uh, battle base and a uh, Rambo uh, a water gun. That's the M60. And I brought some Batman cows into that I had. And they did this, I think they did this too, didn't they? I believe so. I think there's some on the back. I should tell you. They had uh, the Uzi. Yeah, yeah, I've seen that. That's great. I never saw that. I think I've seen this. 
And so then this is the base. Is it all in there or is it like? Yeah, when I bought it, it was sealed. Uh, so I opened it just to make sure that I didn't get uh, a get box of rocks or something. Of, yeah, exactly. But you can, uh, if you guys want to pull it, I don't care. It's just, I've never, it's like a time capsule, I guess you can do it. It's a, it's a, well, yeah, you may, I'm going to do it on the ground. Okay. That's good. It might be easier. Well, I was looking to maybe see what they were worth, and I just brought my little boy, Carson. He's four, just so he can... He's never actually been to a real toy store since, like, Toys R Us, stuff like that don't exist anymore. So we want to let him experience, like, an actual toy store is like, pretty much. So it's not even put together? No, it was sealed when I bought it. Yeah, oh, I, right. I've never... I, I've actually never pulled it all the way out for it, but you can. I don't care. Sure. So were you a Wheeled Warriors fan, or...? Well, my mom bought it for me uh, when she went to the beach when I was a kid uh, years ago, and I always wanted to have another one, so I just, I've been looking for them ever since, and that was the first one I found that was actually not open. Yeah, no, that's great. Seems like it might have been a little... So I don't want to really... All right, well... I'll fix it. It was a great line. It was a great cartoon. It's upside down, but... Yeah, I actually used to have all the vehicles as well, but uh, I don't know where only those are And the World Warriors was kind of just something personal, like, because uh, my mom, she came to the beach, like, when I was three, here in uh, Myrtle Beach, South Carolina, actually, and I... Uh, it was kind of weird. Uh, she she bought that for me, all the, all the vehicles that went with it, and... Uh, so obviously being that young, I didn't remember a lot about it. And uh, the Wheeled Warriors, Warriors, one of the unique things about them is you can interchange all the parts, the wheels, the guns. It's a pretty unique uh, toy line. The cartoon only ran for one year, unfortunately. But uh, um, yeah, it, uh, and so years went by, I didn't realize what it was even. I didn't have it, obviously. I think my older cousins, cousins might've gypped me. But uh, I had the uh, cage and I knew what that was and you know with the internet and stuff I uh, was able to find it again and realize what it was and so I just been looking for them ever since man I found that one on you know eBay like a lot of stuff you know it's a tough line to put together and build uh, do you have any of the cars here you can add them? I might have let me check I think I have a couple yeah so there's uh there's three of them right right in here it's all awesome. awesome and then there's that base all right so yeah i'm just gonna do a little research that's stuff i had when i was little so i kind of wanted to either give it to him or maybe find something he likes better you know because he doesn't seem too interested in them right now but maybe he will when he's older i don't know but i'm just gonna so it just looks like the tape popped just because it's from age yeah. 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 see you're did you type it or just scan it? So, but that's not even an M60. Because you know what an M60 is, right? Yeah. That's the big one. Yeah. yeah. But the okay. ammo belt, that's like an M14 with a st stub. It's still between 14 and 16. Or an M16. Yeah, no, I think maybe I meant to say M16. Oh, no. But there probably is an M14. I don't even know. I don't know. I know World War II stuff. It's almost like it got damp, but not damp. You see how it's separated? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I have an idea on that one, what I would think it would be. Did you have any idea what you're looking to get for all this in your head? No, I don't even know. I was curious to see what they're worth. Yeah, no, that, see, I can't also even... got some Batman cows if y'all want to check them out. Are they like just fan made or? Uh, one of them is, but the other one is a smoldy fiberglass. It's about I'll look big. at it. Yeah. So L J N Rambo. They have a really weird Rambo cockpit. I don't know if you're like flying the chopper, but it's like a goofy. Yeah. We got exactly like right. a joy, or you're shooting at some goofy screen. I had to buy that. So, perfectly sealed one is in that box, right? So, sealed. Okay. So, I would put this probably two. Yeah. Maybe that max, but yeah. Okay. It's covered in dust. <laughs> oh, that's similar. That's cool. I get the other one. It's the other one's fancy. 
So who made that? Besides like Warner Brothers. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I didn't do that. Okay. Oh, Hollywood Collect Hollywood Collectors Gallery. Oh, so that'll be easy enough. So I think I have an ID on that. I've had it on me. It's I got a peanut head, so he, like the average person probably. But I like I said, I wore it. You know, this comes off, of course. It's not. You know, it's just. Did you have the suit too? No, just this. Just bought this off off a uh, half hour. There's a guy on there. To, He's a, I can't remember what his name is, but he's, he's pretty good at them. He does them all 89s. He does. Is I wonder if that's the guy who comes in here. Remember he made yeah, the cow? That's, that's what I was asking. Yeah. Or, yeah, it used to be a guy that made masks and he sold it's some of us. Decent quality. It's oh not, yeah, no, he, did, he does a great job. I found one, the other one. Well, the other one's just gonna be, it's just whatever. Because you remember how long the other one sat here. Um, if it's not licensed, it sits. So, it's, when they had it, it sold for that. Um, I can't even read it. Holy crap. So then let's treat the one as one and then see what he wants on But I can't find a sold one, so I don't know. Maybe well, here. it bottomed out. I don't even know if this company's in business anymore. Okay, so what is it? Hollywood what? Hollywood Collector's Gallery back in hell. And you'll have to sit through. It's not on Worth Point. Oh. Well, you just put 1989. I guess so. Toy Man. You're right. You're mean. <laughs> I know my years. Well, it's 89 Batman. That's what everybody. Oh, right? Calendar King over here. <laughs> okay, so yeah, the, it's just the last. Uh, no, uh, so it's a somewhat of a realistic price in the box. Right. Yeah, it does that. And I forget to ask, was it, were you looking to sell or trade? Well, I just was um, just curious to see what they were. I mean, if the, well, if the I price is right, I mean. I, I subscribe to the service, it's called WorthPoint. Okay. So it stores all data where let's say if you go on eBay, it doesn't show you that far back. Right. Uh, so here it is, you know, but obviously that's not reality. Some stuff just doesn't perform or nobody's looking for it at the moment it's being listed. Right. But then, you know, but then, you know, you can get that. Like, I would probably value it because it's pretty nice box. Like, I have to assign a value to then determine what I would pay. Right. I'd probably say it's worth $200. $200? Okay. And you're probably looking at the base for the Wheeled Warriors roughly the same, give or take. Uh, so then what I would do is I'm going to come in and have that. Right. So I'd give you, <laughs> but then I'm being generous here, right, yeah. because it is, it ain't it ain't necessarily doing that. Yeah, because the toys market it's it's kind of up and down, man. I mean, it's getting, it can change like the wind, you know. It's just one of those things. Now somebody's asking for two hundred or a hundred for a loose one without a box, but I mean that doesn't mean it sells for that. But I mean I wouldn't mind personally owning that. Yeah. I'll just be honest. I'll tell you what I paid for. Okay. <laughs> and I give, uh, man, and I know I paid too much. Well, you paid for a sealed base that you opened. Uh, yeah. So that so cut I, its value. Right. And it's, it's, you're probably not going to believe this, but I actually, I give 350 for the base and I give 450 for Holy that. crap. Yeah, yeah, I did. Because like I said, they, they were personal to me. Right, Because right. I had them when I was a kid. And that's the only reason I, I seeked them out. Um, and then the other thing so is. I understand that part of The it. other thing is, too, is. Right now, just things are weird. Yeah. Things oh, I had off. you should you should have seen me, man. I had uh, Return of the Jedi figures. I mean, tons of these things. Never opened OG ones, and uh, I give. Gosh, this was in '95. I gave well over forty dollars a piece for them back then. But you know, when the internet came, it destroyed a lot of the toys, like the mark, like the value of them because they just got flooded. In yeah, yeah. And all because back then, the only way you could get them was either auction or a yard sale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's it. State sale or something. Just, but now you can just get them. Anywhere, yeah, you know? yeah. So it kind of hurt me there. A lot of my, a lot of my stuff as far as the money I paid. But. Well, that is, yeah. I mean, I'd hate to see you not, you know, yeah. you leave with them. I, but you know, I, I understand if you got. I'm just trying to think. Uh, 
Yeah, what is that? I was just gonna see if any came up. Look at that one. There's a see. Why do they call that an M60 when it's not? I don't know. Right? Yeah, That's an M60. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, that one's a ton. That's the true M60. Wow. So it's not even on there. So I don't know how he found it. But yeah, if you got X that much tied yeah, into the home, just, just being honest with you. No, I, I hear you. All right, well, that one's probably not going to work. But it's cool to see. I feel all right. A little bit. Uh, I feel like I probably paid too much for them when I bought them. But like I said, it was uh, personal. You know, it's meant a lot to me. So that's probably why I paid what I did for them.